वेलकम यू ऑल टू अनदर इंटरेस्टिंग सेशन सो टुडे वी हैव कैनन इमेज रनर एडवांस एंड वी आर गोइंग टू सी द स्कैन टू ईमेल फंक्शंस सो स्कैन टू जीमेल यूजिंग गूगल एसएमटीप इज अ मोस्ट कॉमन वन अक्रॉस आवर कस्टमर सो रीसेंट डेज द गूगल हैज कम अप विद updates where the scan to email functions are not working so let's see how to troubleshoot the scan to gmail function and what are the steps to be taken in order to make it work so now i have a machine in front of me so let me go to scan and i have a address book where i have a gmail stored so let me try to scan to gmail it just one page with the auto color and a4 size and uh, let me stand so the the transaction is on to check the status send job status and click a job log you will come to know ng which is not good no good so the details you can check what is the related uh, error So error code is A39, which is SMTP authentication error. So which means the SMTP what we are given, it is not allowing the email to transfer to the particular account. So let's begin. How to troubleshoot this? Okay, let's open the device remote user interface and log in with the administrator credentials. because administrator account is must to change any sort of informations from the mission so as a security policy you supposed to change the default password for time being i am keeping the same password so here it is login as administrator and toggle to settings registration then you will have network settings under network settings you will normally work on all network related parameters but now since it is a send function let's navigate to send and there are option called network settings where we specify our network details so here i have used smtpgmail.com as my smtp server and i have provided a name to this particular device and i'm using 587 port and i allow dls enable and smtp authentication so as per the error code what we have seen this particular account has some issues or this particular account is not allowing the mail to move on to the respective uh, user respective receiver right So now let's troubleshoot. Normally, when you click check SMTP connection, it should communicate. It should bring back the communication successful. If the communication has an error like this, then we'll have to check what is the reason for it. Let's troubleshoot. The next step, what we should do. if such issues happen first of all we have to make sure the username password of the account is correct which means this particular username do we send to gmail.com is it working email address so let's let's check that first i have the logged in so i can check so it could see I am this email it is active okay and again i could see the critical security alert when my device is trying to scan to email then it's blocking so the email is as reached the account but the account is not releasing the relaying the email so what we should do in this case we have to tolerate the security settings so in order to do that click here account 
and go to account settings and navigate to security tab and here earlier we should there's option called list secure app you have to have enable this then you are allowing the communication the SMTP communication now as a Google policy change the setting is no longer available so what is an alternate method for it so try to look for two-step verification this has to be on get started so once we click it it will ask the the account password the current password of this particular account okay next then it will ask your local mobile number so that it will send you an, an, an uh, the confirmation whether you want a text message or phone call both of it is possible now I have entered my phone number I selected for text message and click next so you can anticipate a message from Google six digit code next it worked two step verification so now I have connected my mobile with my phone so I just made turn on perfect two step verification is turn on since the date now we have two step verification is turn on let's create app password that's the next step click the main menu go to your account and in the search tab look for app passwords so click app passwords it will ask you again to log in with your credentials and I can accept so now click others just create our favorite name now I'm dealing with the machine model call IR advanced C two five six when you click generate you will get a password 16 digit password so please record this password or capture this password because this password will be used in your Google account in your, in in the in the scanner once we have created the app password which is permanent password just log into the machine RUI by using the IP address of the machine and log in as administrator with the username password then select settings registration under function settings look for send option the under send option navigate to network settings in the network settings the SMTP address is smtp.gmail.com and email address is your account details what uh, address you are going to use and if you scroll down further check allow TLS check allow SMTP authentication and type the same account name what you use click change password here you will have to key in the 16 digit password what you got it from the website so just enter the 16 digit password confirm TLS certificate and allow always TLS then click OK after we insert all the details now let's check the SMTP connection we should get the acknowledgement from this connection if it is yes the connection was successful if you remember we had an issue here communication so now the connection was successful which means the server is able to communicate just click ok there are a few more settings just do it go to science and the common settings the default name uh, which I can give image runner advanced 
Favor number. Click OK. Go to communication settings and default subject. Make a scan from image runner advance two five six. So click OK. Address book. And I have two account. Let me select one of this. Click OK. And let me try to scan. I have scanned one page sent. Check the status monitor to check the mail is being transmitted. And click the job log. The result is nothing, which means. It is already transmitted. So, in order to check, check your email whether you have received or not. I have received a mail from here at once C256 and subject also scan. And this is my page, one single page. So, by doing this, you can make your scan to gmail work and uh, it is quite possible thanks for watching this clip see you soon